just how much destruction can the 50 BMG really cause? Today, we're putting ball, AP, and API rounds to the test, and the results might surprise you. Welcome back to 3R Ballistics. And in this video, we're exploring the terminal ballistics of the 50 BMG as we work toward the ultimate goal of figuring out how to stop these massive rounds in future tests. We'll be firing at mild steel, aluminum, and even recycled body armor. But more about the recycled body armor at the end of the video. <laughs> so let's head out to the ranch range unleash some serious firepower and capture the destruction in slow motion for your viewing pleasure. To give you an example of the 50 BMG, just the ball round, we are going to hit uh, some concrete. We had some leftover concrete from our strong man over there. And behind it, we have a little white dust. See what we can get. Here we go. You ready? Okay, here we go. We are going to go ahead, set up the black tip. We have three quarters inch mild steel. Um, with some soda behind there. We missed the slow-mo on the last one. We'll make sure to get it for you this time. Okay, so walking up, this is the absolute mess that we got. Let me put you down and I'll show you this <laughs> three quarter inch plate. Um, <laughs> we got some ooze in there, but it went straight through. Um, absolutely no problem whatsoever. So let's uh, let's do something a little bit more flashy. We'll go from there. So we put a one inch aluminum plate and some water with some red cut red uh, food coloring on it just to uh, give it some contrast out there. Try to try to wash off that table. But we got uh, you know an aluminum color for an aluminum plate. Hopefully, we'll get a little bit more oxidation. Okay, here we go. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Woo, -hoo -hoo. Woo. All right, to finish this off, 
before the body armor. We got one more little test to do. Another aluminum plate. Okay, you good? Okay, here we go. After seeing the complete destruction that this black tip AP can do, I'm a little hesitant to say that we could stop a, uh, you know, AP 50 BMG with that body armor. <laughs> but you know what? We're going to give it a shot. We're going to see what destruction we get. Here we go. Oh, baby! I had just uh, held this on with a little tape. And what did our plate do? It did not stop that 50 BMG. You know what? There's a lot of good plate. I want to hit it again with one of the flashy flashes. Right up here. Let's see what we can do with a flashy flash. Okay. To send this guy off properly, we're going to use this blue and black tip which is an Israeli, I believe, API. These typically go a little bit faster and should punch uh, just as hard. I believe it's the same core. We go. Oh, yeah. The body, body armor flung way over here. As you can see, just ripped this thing straight through. Um, what I am surprised about is this concrete. For all those that don't know, the barricades, the retaining wall, and this are things I made. They're reinforced, but holy smokes. What I can't believe is that concrete, both cores of those are right in there. So what did I mean by recycled material? Well, these are R&D plates. 
we have been r and d some material, some material science. And what we did is we ended up taking a level four plate, which was this down here, and added another layer of, of uh, alumina ceramic. Now, before we wrap it up, I wanna point out that today's recycled body armor plate was just a baseline. It's a plate, the R&D plate, like I mentioned, we had some leftover components and we ended up just adding that extra ceramic tile. You know, it measured 10 by 12, I'm sorry, 12 by 10. It was one and a half inches thick, total thickness. It weighed 10.3 pounds. Um, but our real goal moving forward is to find out the lightest, thinnest, and most practical material uh, or combination of materials that can actually stop uh, AP50 BMG with an out, with, without an insane price tag. Um, while today's testing was a lot of fun and full of uh, destruction, there's real purpose behind the madness. We learned some stuff, whether you caught that or not. Um, we obviously used materials that we knew each one of these would go through. And if you've got an idea for material or material combo that you think could stop the AP50 BMG, drop it down in the comments. And if you wanna see just what it really takes to stop this round, make sure and subscribe because we have some incredible tests coming up. But thanks for watching and until the next one.